times. It's not, not possible. Ah, I don't have to beg him or offer him money. Who, who is he? My son is my son. What's happening? And you're asking me what's happening? Huh? You're asking me what's happening? Are you not the one who caused all this? Are you not the one who put me in this, this whole this mess? Huh? And you're here asking me questions. You just shut up. I don't even blame anyone. I blame father for inviting that low life to this palace. He can take the case wherever he wants to. Michael is my son. Nobody can change that. What exactly are you talking about, Francis? You need to let me in on this. Mom, you see it. You see it. I told you that that, that stupid move only suggests that father is in doubt of my paternity over Michael. You see it. But you know that's not true. And please stop saying that. Now go down there and see your father. I don't want to see him. I'm pissed off. I'm going somewhere else. You had better go and talk to that ex-boyfriend of yours before he lands himself into trouble. I need your help. I need your help. I'm very sorry for my outburst the last time I came here. Please. <coughs> you need my help. After you must have embarrassed me and told you that we are done. Huh? I need you to help me talk to Collins. Help me talk to him before he ruins something, before he ruins my life. Please. You want me, Tina, to talk to Collins? Really? Excuse me. Tina. You can say what you like, but I'm not listening. Uh. My mind's made up. I know what I'm doing. Uh. She touched my heart uh. in a special way. Uh. I won't give in, I won't give up. Can't let her go away. Uh. She's mine. That girl. The girl is mine, that girl is mine, she loves my mind, she looks so fine. The girl is mine, that girl. I'm adjoining this case for the parties involved that are expected or directed by this honorable court to go for their DNA test in the State General Hospital. They should bring results in the next sitting. Having said that, therefore, the councils should pick a date for the next hearing. They should do that without wasting our time, please. This check is for two million naira. It's for you. Two million? For me? Dr. Luke, do you know what the toad said? Tell me, Your Highness. The toad said that he has decided to adopt a combat posture because he heard that the man coming to see him is a good wrestler. I have seen the way that boy is going about this case. I too have decided not to rest on my oars. I have decided to do something and that's why I'm here. You've made a wise decision, Your Highness. You have nothing to be afraid of. Beautiful. 
Very good. Your Highness. I shall take my leave. The rest is up to you. I will do as requested. Why are you doing this to me? I thought you walked away from my life for good. Now you are back to ruin me. What have I done to you? Oh my God. I have to do something before it's too late. I have to. Cassandra, I don't know what you're doing in my house again. I've told you to leave me alone. Leave me alone, please. I don't want to get involved in this matter again, please. Tina, you're the closest friend I've ever had. Are you serious? <laughs> I thought you called me a traitor. I need your help. I know that you can help me. Talk to colleagues. Beg him on my behalf. Beg him to withdraw the case from court. That's all I ask for. I have a question for you, Cassandra. Was I the one that told colleagues to take the case to court in the first place? Huh? My marriage is in danger. Just talk to colleagues. I believe he will listen to you. Listen to me, my good friend. Like you called yourself. Like I told you before, count me out of this case. I don't want to have anything to do with you or any case concerning you again. Because I don't want you to come to my house and start calling me names again. You hear me? Have a nice day. Can say what you like, but I'm not listening. Oh. My mind's made up. I know what I'm doing. Oh. She touched my heart oh. in a special way. Oh. I won't give in. I won't give up. Can't let her go away. Oh. She's mine. That girl is mine. She loves my mind. She looks so. The girl is mine That girl is mine She loves my mind She looks so fine The girl is mine That girl is mine She loves my mind She looks so fine The girl is mine There you go. I went to see a friend She's friend what took you to Tina's place? Oh, enough. Enough already, Francis. Do I have to explain my every move to you? Give it a rest already. Sandra, get back here. Sandra! Tell me why you went to Tina's house. I'm not telling you. Kill me if you want to. I'm giving you five seconds to tell me why you went there. One. Two. And I said, kill me. Three. Because that's all I want. You, 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 you.
Hello? Hello? Ah, good day, sir. How are you? I'm fine, sir. You're welcome. This is Dr. Luke's office. So, where is he? It is, sir, but he's not around. What do you mean he's not around? I have an arrangement to see him here now. Where is he? Actually, Dr. Luke had a fatal accident on his way to work this morning. As I speak to you right now, he's lying unconscious. Young man, don't joke with me. I want to see Dr. Luke. Take me to see him. I want him. I'm sorry, sir, you can't. What do you mean, I can't? Take me to Dr. Luke now, or I will eat sir? you! Excuse me, sir. Father, father. father. Jesus. So what's going on? What's going on? What was that about? I don't know. He was asking me about Dr. Luke. Honestly, I don't really know what is happening here. I don't know. I'm just confused. I've gone through these DNA results. I must inform that none of these two parties match up with the little boy's DNA. Based on this, this honorable court gives her judgment. One, it is contrary to the natural justice, equity and good consciousness to allow the plaintiff to claim the child of another man. Two, though the defendant is not the biological father of the child in question, he should be allowed to continue looking after the child until the biological father is found. Okay, now, if Francis is not the father of the boy, 
and I am not the father of the boy. Who then is the father? Who? Collins! What is wrong with you? Why are you being stubborn? Huh? The court's decision is final. So what do you want to do about this now? What do you want to do about this mother now? I cannot stop. I will not stop until I get my son back to me. Yes! That boy is my son. Collins. Collins! Collins! How many times did I call you? How many times did I call you? Now you listen. A housefly that does not have an advisor and has the grave with the cops. Yes. Yes. Why are you sounding like this? Mama, why are you sounding like this? Okay, Mama. Is it now a crime for someone to fight for what belongs to him? Is it now a crime? No, Papa, tell me. Is it a crime? Collins. Collins. Think twice. Think twice. Before you start saying, and I know. Think twice, my son. Papa, Papa. There will be no had I know. No court. No judge. Can deprive me of what belongs to me. I must have my son back to me. I must take my son. No court. Don't give me that no court. All right. Then go. Francis, a person who has run a race should not start panting like a woman. You have lived with your wife happily. Why now? Well, I don't understand what you're talking about. I totally do not understand what you're talking about. Cassandra is no longer my wife. Will you shut up? What's come over you? Are you out of your mind? I am not out of my mind, Father. I am in my right senses. And I have taken a decision, and that decision stands. It's my life. Excuse me, Francis. Francis, are you walking out? Are you walking out? I don't want to hear your voice. 
Back these things outside the gate, throw them out. Come back, back her and this bastard boy out. Now! My queen, please. Thank you. Help me, Becky. My queen. Is Francis DNA different from his? A lot has happened, Collins. It's a very long story. It's not after what happened the last time that caused the miscarriage. I'm, I'm much more careful this time. Mm -hmm. So, when are you coming back to do your clearance? I miss you, you know that. And it gets really lonely in here. Ah! <laughs> 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 Take, take whatever it is you want. Now, pull up everything. Yes. Eh? Everything and spread your legs. Now! Please, please, just, just take, take whatever, anything you want to take. I said spread your legs. Now! <laughs> now! Lay down there.
What am I doing here? Don't worry, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. What happened to me? Relax, let me get the doctor. Just relax. Ah! <sighs> Excuse me, nurse. I've been asking a question since morning and till now I'm yet to get an answer. How did I get here? I really want to know. Well, a man brought in here yesterday. I don't know his name. He said he picked you up on the road. He was here this afternoon. He's been the one taking care of your bills and other things. A man? Now is to relax your mind, you'll be alright. Nurse, how is she doing? She's fine, sir. What are you doing here? He's the man I was telling you about. Huh? No. No, it it can't be him. So I think you should be leaving. She doesn't need to be disturbed at the moment. It's all right, Molly. Just take very good care of her, please. You need to relax, too. You'll be all right. I'll go get your drugs. <laughs> Sandra, my daughter, uh, we thank God that you are alive today. You see, uh, Francis called me on phone this morning and told me exactly what happened to you. Huh? You mean he, he called you? Yes, uh, he called me. You see, Francis is a very good person. Even the doctor has told us how he's been taking care of you. How did you get my father's phone number? Francis, my son, you really see, I really appreciate your kindness to my daughter. Who knows what would have become of her if you had not come to her rescue? Thank you very much. It's all right, sir. You don't have to thank me too much. I believe God uses people to bless people. So it's okay. It's okay. Um, I sent a nurse to get her dinner. I believe the nurse will be back by now. Oh, that is very good of you. Uh, I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. And I pray that the Almighty God will bless you with all the good things of this life. In Jesus' name. Amen. Bless you too. I don't know how to start to express my gratitude to you. Uh, you did not only save the life of my daughter, but you took care of her and also pay the hospital bills. May God reward you abundantly in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Uh, Mr. Ruben, we thank God for everything. Um, I'll be on my way now. But I'll be coming from time to time to check on her. Oh, you are welcome. Anytime, any day. In fact, I want you to take my house as your second home. Please. Uh, before I leave, this is actually for you in case of any emergencies. If she needs anything, please get some help. All this for us. After all you spent in the hospital on her behalf, you are still giving us more money. Oh my God. 
God will bless you. God will bless you, my son. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Cassandra, please take very good care of yourself. I'll leave now. It's okay. Bye bye, my son. My daughter, it is time you told me who this God sent young man is to you. But now I have Francis to bother me. Francis frequents this house. He swoops in and out at will. Why? Because my parents have taken a liking to him. Do you blame your parents? You don't have to blame them. My dear, I myself am so impressed. I mean, look, the Francis I knew way back in school, Roger Francis. I'm so impressed that a sudden turn around, his good exhibition of character. I'm impressed. <laughs> and he even said he's a prince. Yeah. So? Francis, you're already here. Yes, I am here. You're welcome, my son. Thank you, Mr. Ruben. How are you today? I'm fine. I'm fine, my son. I have some goodies for you. Boys, bring down everything from the trunk. Everything, everything. Hand them over to Mr. Ruben. some days now. You must have missed me. Ah, oh, I missed you too. It's okay. We've been here for some time now. You still have not said a thing as to why we're here. I'll tell you. Ah. I brought you here because I want us to celebrate your recovery. I'm happy. Don't you like it? You're not a nice person. Why then are you suddenly nice to me? Ah. Well, I'm being nice to you because I'm a changed person now. You've always known me as a bad guy, but that was way back in school. I admit I was rough. I did quite a lot of nasty things, but I did those things out of youthful exuberance. Right now I'm older. I'm wiser. I've changed totally. The Francis of today is not the Francis of yesterday. Believe me. And again, I believe that fate has brought us together.
Well, I'd like to thank you for your kindness towards me in recent times. That's all right. You don't have to thank me because I'm still going to do more. So much more. I am ready to do anything, everything, anything for you. Just name it. You know why? Because I love you. Because I have always loved you. Even when we were in school, I did a lot of nasty things, but pardon me, that was the only way I knew I could express myself then. Now I'm older, I'm wiser, I can talk, and I'm talking. I really love you. Believe me, I care about you. I can give you the world. You be my wife. Just when you think it's over, you look inside your heart and discover that you're still in love. sort of proposal coming from a man like Francis there's no way I am going to accept that kind of proposal have you told your parents about this tell them I haven't told them and I don't even intend to we both know how much they love and cherish Francis so where do I get off telling them this Francis is a changed person, judging from his recent reactions. Don't be upset now. Don't be upset. Listen, my good friend. I'm not trying to get you upset. I'm here to tell you the truth. Yes. Go ahead and marry Francis. Francis is rich. He's handsome. Come to think of it. Do you know what would have become of you if not for him? And to crown it all, he's a prince. My good friend, don't misuse this opportunity. I'm telling you, I will not mislead you as your good friend. Go ahead and marry him. Okay. I'm going. Take my advice. Are hard to find. And like your friend advised you, make good use of this opportunity. This is an opportunity other young ladies like you are looking for. Think. Please. Think. Thank you. How are you? 
Thank you. What about your parents? Are they home? No, they, they went out. Come with me, I want to show you. What? Just when you think it's over, you look inside your heart and discover that you're still in love. What am I supposed to? I bought this car for you. <sighs> no, you didn't. You what? Yes. Oh my god. You like it? Yes. Yes. Yes, I do. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. See, that's why I said, come with me, I have something to show you. Yeah. Ah, I'm glad you like it. Hop, hop in, let's, let's take a ride. Um, I don't know how to drive. Don't worry, I came prepared. I'll drive. Days after the proposal, I went to the hospital for medical checkups. And I was stunned when the doctor said, He said that I was two weeks gone. I couldn't tell Francis. Because he hadn't slept with me. So. My son is a product of rape. I never meant to abandon you. I still love you. And I want you back to me. I can't live with all these memories. No. I take responsibility for all you've been through. I'm sorry. I still love you and I want you back in my life. We can still make it together as one big family. Nice. 
here it is. Very weak. I... am not sure I can survive this. It's okay, Your Highness. You'll be all right. You'll be fine, Father. not believe what I am going to tell you now. I committed many atrocities on this land. Please, stop saying this. I can't. The burden is too much on me. Son, I... 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 I used you. you, you I used your and see us a man. Oh. A sacrifice to the brotherhood. Oh. It, you, you, you would never impregnate any woman. Father. What? Huh? See, son, I knew, I knew your, your, your son, Mike, the one you called your son, is not your son after all. That, that, that's why. I was anxious to, to pay Collins off. When he refused, I... I followed him. I followed him to kill him. But he... he eluded me. Father, why? Huh? Why? I mean, what have I done to you to, to deserve such, such, such wickedness? Why, why, why? Why me, Father, why? Brotherhood. 